Hey everybody, Brian here from quantlabs.net. I uh, just wanted to show people uh, some of the cool stuff you can get with uh, the next two set of uh, model forecasting types that I'm looking at. I've shown the reasoning behind uh, the model types that I've uh, selected and why I'm going in the order that I'm going. Uh, all these type of postings uh, where I go through a couple of days of research on each type of model research uh, type, or sorry, model forecasting type. I post uh, the results and the actual code, source code, uh, to my uh, to my uh, Quant Elite members. So I'm moving ahead uh, with, it, as I said, Arima, as well as uh, the next one I'm looking at is MCMC Markov Chain uh, with Monte Carlo simulation. So I'm just going to show you some of the results you can get with looking for MATLAB um, search in Google with uh, Arima and specifically using finance. So some of the results are here. I'm just going to quickly highlight some of them. Now the beautiful thing I love about MATLAB is I can use today's documentation because here you'll see um, that these are specific on the versions on which these work. Um, I've had a lot of issues with both Python and R. Uh, it's my big big beef with a lot of the open source stuff out there. It's just not future proof. Uh, and I just don't trust a lot of scripts that I will be writing for my own implementation and deployment in my own trading systems over uh, the long run. So that's a big concern for me. Uh, it's a big concern for my uh, funders and capital providers as well. So this is why I only focus on industry grade tools like MathWorks. Some can argue it and uh, that's their business. Uh, this is my reasoning um, and every person that comes to me uh, and that's ranging from large trading desks and um, uh, geez, in, in huge operations as well as some of the biggest corporations on the planet come to me for this reason. Um, they, don't, they, don't, they will not, and I'll repeat this, will not ever, and you might get some limited uh, open source in those environments, but they won't take any third-party um, unproven uh, packages or libraries or toolboxes, whatever has been written. It has to come through a, a, a reputable vendor like, uh, in this case, MathWorks, as well as Microsoft uh, as their preferred uh, vendors of choice, from my experience. You know, there's none of that ranting on, um, but let's, let's explore some of the results we get with um, the Serima search results for MATLAB. Okay, so we're now in the current version of R 2014A. I've done my own little review on that version, nothing really earth shattering. I personally used uh, R 2013A, um, and uh, here's some results I get. Some of the powerful things I really like about this uh, stuff. I'm just I'm just doing this, winging it. This is not a rehearsed uh, video. Um, so again, estimate is a, is a powerful uh, function you can get in MATLAB. Um, so again, these are the sort of things I do explore um, just to see uh, what goes on. Now a lot of other cool stuff about a lot of the stuff are the research papers that go into um, the thought of using MATLAB. Uh, MATLAB is really pretty well used throughout. It's pretty well the industry um, standard at a lot of the universities. I know R is getting out there, but I mean MATLAB is just used everywhere from what I see in a lot of big schools, but I'm not in big schools, so what do I know? But I do see some really cool um, research papers that come up. Um, so a lot of these I go through um, and try to demo them, and, and at some point what I try to do is try to uh, implement them into my live trading, well I will say live trading, but at least uh, real time uh, uh, my little platform or little system that I have that has access to real time data. And that can, from what I've seen, uh, play, uh, it does keep up with a lot of the tick data, um, no matter what type of data it is. So again, uh, moving along here, we got the Econometrics Toolbox. This is one powerful uh, toolbox here. This one a lot of people may be interested in is understanding the volatility modeling and forecasting and of course Monte Carlo simulation which is part of this econometrics toolbox. I do know that they've uh, made some changes to it but it, it's a pretty powerful um, toolbox as part of MATLAB. Um, and again, again we, we continue along. This is an entire course from what I've seen in this um, uh, institution here. It sounds Italian. Amazing people what uh, some of the Italians are bringing out. Um, a lot of the big stuff is from Italy. 
<coughs> anyways, sneezing away. <coughs> allergy time here. Uh, regardless, excuse me. So here's a whole course on MATLAB. Um, so we get a lot of the materials. Um, so you can probably go through this this whole course. I've not gone through this. As I said, this is uh, um, this is uh, really uh, winging it. I haven't even looked at any of this stuff. I'm just showing you some of the stuff that is out there. Again, here's another research paper. Um, some of this is good. Some of it may be useful, but. Um, I'm really interested in the Arima. I played a lot, a lot with the world of Arima in R. Um, it's there's some good stuff in in um, the world of R. Um, but again, I just don't want to have that. As I said, the, the the current scripts that I have probably will break in the new version of R 3.1 or whatever the current version of R is. So unfortunately, I'm not going to even bother um, looking into that. I just can't be bothered spending another. You're trying to save money with our open source and then the, the expense of the time it takes to get something working in open source is just honestly not worth it to me. So anyways, uh, again, um, analysis of the time series. We got some <coughs> plots going on here. Uh, I gotta get through all this. One of the things people, I want people to understand here is these little algorithms that you'll find in a lot of these research papers. Um, I have a way of being, not easily, but fairly, uh, I don't want to say the word easily, but it, it's pretty, we'll just lay, leave it as trivial, where I have a way you can take this algorithm, code it up in the scientific notation, and then convert it using uh, MutePad in MATLAB, and then being able to uh, generate your M script from it, and then you can generate your DLL, and that can easily be deployable in your trading uh, system, or the one I have. So we, sh we show that in, in the Quantly uh, courses that I have, <clears throat> and uh, that is very powerful. It's a huge time saver. The trivial thing for me is understanding what these algorithms mean. Um, they can be pretty daunting for a lot of people, including me. Uh, I like to look at things that are really meant for preschoolers, like one plus two equals three. Uh, so again, we're uh, moving along. Um, some interesting things. Now, uh, a lot of MATLAB questions on Stack Overflow. Uh, I like Stack Overflow, but lately it's been run by what I'll call a bunch of Nazis. Uh, you can't even get your question posted, um, and uh, it's pretty well rendered useless, that website. But there's still some useful uh, information on there. Um, and again, coming back to the MathWorks site itself, lots of lots of killer examples on uh, MATLAB, so you can see uh, some good examples here um, using Monte Carlo simulation. and. These sort of things are, are pretty pretty killer, um, and uh, I, I don't know any other tool as, as powerful as uh, MATLAB and as easy as to use. And of course, we, we break it down to the Arima class, uh, which is um, what I'll be focusing uh, probably in the next few days. I'm probably introducing maybe a high-level video, trying to implement some stuff coming from IKFeed using some of these links that may be useful for my um, membership and uh, the community in general. So that's Arima. Um, some powerful stuff. There's probably others. I could go on our blogger and look at some stuff as well. And there's a ton of it. I've done it before. Some fantastic stuff. But again, I'm just going to focus on what I see in MATLAB. Uh, I don't need to go on about any more reasons on that. Okay, hopefully this is helpful for some people. I know there's going to be lots to want to criticize, but criticize away. <laughs> doesn't stop me, but um, hopefully uh, others will get some benefit of it and save them a lot of time. Talk to you later.